Drag matters because it's always been a pivotal influence, especially in the queer community. It's always been the thing that moves us forward. If you look at every single part of our journey, queens were there leading the fight. And that's why it matters. Hi, I'm Honey Davenport from RuPaul's Drag Race season 11. Happy Pride! Legit growing up, I was a mama's boy. Um, and like being queer was just something I hadn't talked with my mom about. And it was just so strange that I was just like, how can I talk to you about everything and not this? You know, not the fact that I like the D. So when my boyfriend broke up with me, I was like devastated. And I called my mom and it's 2 a.m. in the morning and I'm sobbing. Like, I, and I don't like pretty cries. So this is like an ugly cry moment. And I'm like, mom, are you sleeping? Are you sitting down? What are you doing? She's like, baby, I'm in this bed. This better be real important. And I was like, listen, mom, you know, I just have to tell you that I'm gay and I've hurt myself for 19 years to spare your feelings, but I can't do this any longer. And she was like, you know what? You hurt yourself for 19 years to spare my feelings. And for that, I love you more. And that is my whole coming out story. We went from that point on. I mean, the drag thing threw her for a loop. But like, she's like, okay, you like to suck dick, fine, go. I think drag is when someone uses themselves as a medium for art. It's just basically you are the canvas and it's all encompassing. It like goes on multiple levels, whether you use it with your music or you use it with acting or you use it with your fashion. And there've been people who are high up in every industry who use like a persona as the canvas for their art. And to me, that's what drag is. The final look, hunties, the Honey Davenport illusion. It is just another platform, another medium in which I can express myself. Drag has always been important in our community. It has always been a revolutionary game changer. Art is just a mirror held up to life. And I think that drag has always been that beautiful mirror, that reflection of what life is, that also, in the very, very best of times, points out the imperfections in the world and creates us a journey to start to where we need to be. Shade and reading are things that the queer African American experience created that are now used for the whole LGBTQ plus experience as a whole. Wow, that's a lot of whole. 